So I keep getting asked all the time, Taddy Collector, how do you score free video games? Well, stay tuned. I'm about to show you. wild and you're hunting for video games well you're gonna have to spend some money you can't just get them straight up free but if you follow this process you'll never spend a dime on any of your games in your collection so here we go to the kitchen let's check it out okay so let's say you ran across all these games out in the wild whether it be at pawn shops or uh, yard sales or whatever the case may be these are just a few of the scores I, I obtained recently, but I haven't paid a dime for any of these. None of them. So, how do you score them for free? Well, it's really easy. So, what you're going to do is when you're going out to pawn shops or yard sales or uh, garage sales, flea markets, wherever it is that you're going out looking for games, you're going to pick up the games you want um, as cheap as you can. And then you're going to pick up what's called a flipper. This flipper is going to be bought for very cheap, but sold for a hefty price so that you can recoup the money that you've spent total over all the games that you bought that day. So, uh, alright. So let's say I got Hot Shots Tennis, and I got Grand Theft Auto Vice City, and Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, and Grand Theft Auto 3... And some more Xbox games, Proficient, Outlaw, Volleyball. Now, I'm not sure what the total is over all of these, but let's just say that their total value altogether is like $15. Okay, well what you're going to want to do, and I've just found this recently too, is find a game that's worth at least that much, if not more. And that you can also get for a really cheap price. Now I picked this up. Um, how much did I spend? Like two fifty-three dollars for De Def Jam Fight for New York. Now this disc is about twenty dollars. Um, so let's just say you spent fifteen here. Plus this makes eighteen dollars. So let's say you can flip it for twenty, and you sell this for twenty. All right. So you just sold that game that recouped all the money that you spent here and you can put all of these in your collection for free. You haven't spent a dime because you were able to sell the flipper. Now that's how you collect video games for free. That's how you get video games for free. All right, but let's say you can't find a flipper that day. Let's say you've gone and spent all this money on these video games, but you can't find a video game that's worth money that you can flip to recoup all the money that you've already spent. Well, that's where you look for other items. You look for other items of value that you can get really cheap but that you can sell for what they're worth, such as VCRs, graphing calculators, um, maybe a painting, or some type of electronic that you can get really cheap. Anything that you can buy cheap, sell for what it's worth, and make all your money back that you've spent on your video games. There's another option. Okay, there's another way. Let's say that um, someone has posted this lot of games, right? And let's say that they've got, I don't know, a $40 price on all of them. So you can buy all of these for $40. Well, you're only interested in Dragon's Lair Trilogy, Silent Hill, Harvest Moon, and maybe Def Jam Fight for New York. 
So what you're going to do is you're going to buy the entire lot. And then once you get the lot, you're going to separate the games that you want in your collection. Right? And then you're going to sell the rest for the same price that you bought the entire lot for. If the total value of these games equals that amount. Now, when you buy lots, you want the total value of the games, the entire lot, you want it to be more than what they're asking. So that you can pick out the games you want for free, or that you want to put in your collection, and sell the rest to recoup the money that you spent on the entire lot, and then you just pick yourself up two, three, four games for free. And then you can slide those into your collection. So there you go, folks. That's how you do it. That's how you get video games for free. So all you got to do is put in a little bit of work, get out there and hustle, make that sale, find you a flipper, and you can do it. You can add all these video games you want for free right into your collection. All right. I've got links down in the description to my pages. This is your boy, Teddy Collector, and have a good one.